I'm not sure which is more addictive, APRS or Meshtastic. Stick around and we'll get right to it. Hey, welcome back guys, Jason, KM4ACK. For the last couple of months, I have been deep diving Meshtastic and I have come up with a slew of new nodes, many of those which you've already seen on the channel. But the thing is, is most of them are fairly similar. I mean, maybe the battery size changes, maybe the screen changes. Yeah, there's a few different boards out there. Some of them are better with battery life than others, but there's not anything that I've seen that really sets one node apart from the next. Well, that's until now. Elicro reached out and asked me if they could send me a couple of nodes. Now, the first one they sent me was this M2 node, and this is kind of like the rest of them that I've got. I mean, it's got the basic screen on it. It's a fairly small node. Um, it, it's okay. I like it, uh, but there's nothing really to write home about. Uh, it does include a buzzer in it or a beeper. So uh, if you get a message either in long, fast or direct, it will give you an audible alert. So that's kind of cool. And you don't see that in a whole lot of nodes. This one happens to have a fixed antenna. Another thing that personally, I'm just not a big fan of. However, what's more interesting is the M1 node that they sent me. This one is really, really unique. You can use the dial up here at the top to make the screen brighter or dimmer. By the way, that's an e-ink display. And one of the things that I find very interesting and definitely unique about this particular node, it does come with a detachable antenna. So if you want to pull this off and swap it out, you can do so. Maybe you want a larger battery. Maybe you want to drop this in some kind of waterproof enclosure and use it as a remote node. Uh, probably wouldn't be my choice for that, but you could do that easily because of that removable antenna. Another very unique feature of this node is this slide switch right here on the top. It's not a power switch. Well, it is, but it's not a power switch for the overall unit. This is a power switch just for the GPS. So if we simply slide that switch down, the GPS is in the off position. It just gave me an audible alert, letting me know that I turned the GPS off. So I like the fact that we've got a hard kill switch for the GPS. That can definitely save some battery. Now, speaking of battery life, Went ahead and turned it on and it gives me another audible alert. Speaking of battery life, I powered up the GPS and turned this node on. I went ahead and updated it to the latest Meshtastic firmware and I booted this thing up at around 2.30 in the afternoon. And it lasted until roughly 9 o'clock the next evening, so a little over 24 hours and I still had about 9% battery left. So I went ahead and just recharged it at that point, but you can definitely get a full 24 hours out of this node, and I'm sure a lot of that's because of that e-ink display, and if you want to get a little longer, you could go ahead and turn off the GPS and probably get a little bit more out of that battery. Now, right on the front of the screen, it does give you a list of nodes that you've heard. By the way, I went ahead and put the heads-up display firmware on here. Now, if I press the bottom button that's over here on the side, it will cycle between those nodes heard, uh, messages that I've received, and it has something else for positions, but I haven't quite figured that out. I do kind of see an X on the screen, but I don't have a map. So I need to do a little bit more digging and see if we can load at least some sort of crude map onto that so we could see those positions. Just like the M2, this one also has a speaker inside and will give you an audible alert when you receive a message. So there's a look at both the M1 and the M2. M2 is not a bad node, it just wouldn't be my first choice. If I was going to pick one of these two, it would definitely be the M1 with that e-ink display. And I'll leave links in the description to both of these. If you found today's information helpful, be sure to give us a thumbs up before you head off. We will see you guys on the next one. Until then, 7-3.